good day everyone my name is Arsalan and welcome to my YouTube channel so I hope you guys are good uh, you know by intro it um, it sometimes changes uh, anyways you know uh, check out all the the projects that I have previously done so I hope you guys enjoyed all of these videos I hope you learned something from this and today um, is another video from our facade series um, because I am in love with my facades uh, today we are going to be making you know the diamond uh, sort of a diamond shaped facade right and uh, I hope everything is going good on the, on your side and uh, you know I hope you're safe <laughs> during the conflict that we have going on uh, you know it's uh, there's nothing to be happy about I mean it's sad when humans are killing and fighting one another anyways uh, you know so I changed the shape into a rhomboid I set the size by 1.5 by 3 meters now we go to points and uh, normal points and uh, set and let's set this to that so one and uh, two and uh, three and uh, four and we go to modify we select on this we go to filters we go to reference points yes these are the ones that we chose now we go to what one meters and we change this to you know we change this to a controllable parameter right because I want to control this uh, this property um, so we go to new and what is this going to be four points uh, vertical of set okay I mean the names can be whatever right um, as long as you understand when you by the end when you have made so many different names right you have to differentiate between all of them now um let's try to oops oh my god we have to connect it one by one so this and this and uh, connect by spline and uh, connect by spline guys oh my god what are we doing so click on this click on this and uh, spline and um, okay and uh, click click on this and uh, click on this <coughs> excuse me uh, spline and um, guys why am I messing this up this is so simple okay um, spline and the reference line and um, spline uh, click on this click on this and uh, spline and uh, reference line and finally the last one what uh, okay so you know I'm trying to make my videos as fast as possible so that uh, you guys can learn in a very short amount of time okay once uh, once this is done now we need more points so one two three and four and we we even need to control this parameter right so uh, let's first of all just simply connect um, this okay and uh, let's go to this and let's go to this and uh, connect and reference line and uh, we click on this so uh, this um, parameter right here we need to control 0 0.6 and uh, what is this what is this why uh, so let's press on this to flip the value now 0 0.6 okay so that's a 0 0.6 and uh, let's click on this so I think we need to flip that again and uh, 0 0.6 okay now let's click on this and we need to flip it again so 0 0.6 okay now we need to we even have to control this parameter we want to change this property into a controllable parameter so new and a new so what is what is the name of this going to be four points um, horizontal uh, offset okay four points horizontal offset uh, okay and uh, in this case let's click on this so again four points vertical offset all right and uh, four points vertical offset the same case for this and uh, you know we want to make our shape as controllable as possible right so that it's fun to play around with it in the end and now two more points so uh, let's click on this what is this gonna be um, we need to flip this um, what 0.8 okay and uh, same keys with this so um we need to flip this to 0 0.8 and uh, change this into a controllable parameter again so for this we need new so th what is this going to be two uh, points we are ti uh, ticl vertical um off set uh so two points vertical offset okay 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 and uh, this one again um okay two points vertical offset right fine and look at the progress we have everything is on point guys so now let's click on this and uh, let's uh, click on what okay this and uh, let's click on um, this 
and uh, let's uh, collect it by spline and let's go to reference line all right everything is good right now um one and um uh, uh what else did we have to do okay this and uh, we need some sort of this this horizontal shape right so click uh, connect both of them also and uh, let's click on this and uh, let's uh, click on this so spline all right connected now one and uh, two and uh, three and uh, four and click on this and uh, let's choose this and what do you want uh, the thickness of this is to it can be um 20 mm 30 mm right 0 0.025 how about 25 mm and uh, perfect uh so guys check this out this is our parametric uh shape and uh for these we can change this to other two d d d d d dimensions okay and even for this one to um d for dimensions um, um all right so check this out our entire shape is within our control i mean the two points uh we can change this to 75 and uh, click apply and check this out it changed and this one can be to 0 0.4 uh, um, point right this has to be a point to so apply and check this out that is within our control and uh, 0 0.9 and apply and all right everything is perfect now um we need a reference our our rectangle a set and uh, let's set it to this All right, and uh, you know I even want to change the width of this to a controllable parameter. So, for example, if we click on this, this is tab, and uh, this is the dimension that shows up. So let's click on this um, this sign right here. Let's click on the dimension. And let's change this to a rectangle. R e c t a n g l e rectangle. A w i d t h. Okay, width. All right, now um, what? Let's click on this. And uh, let's click on this and uh, let's click on this and let's go to this. All right, check this out, guys. Look at how um, nice it looks. And uh, you know, everything is within our control. 0 0.1, apply and check this out. Uh, okay, so now, um, you know, our, our fact kit is already made new uh, project, uh, architectural template. Come on, come on. I want my videos to be short and in place mass okay all right and uh, 3d close it all in active views and uh, line and one and uh, two and uh, un and uh, change this to meters two decimal places m m all right change this to what to 30 meters and uh, let's go to create form and uh, let's click on this to uh, 30 meters again and oh my god i've said so many things in short amount of time uh divide surface let's click on this let's go to two 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 rhomboid and <coughs> excuse me let's go to fixed distance and uh, let's go to fixed distance again if you guys remember what was it it was three by 1.5 by three right apply 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 yes perfect now uh okay we did not load our family um load family load family come on come on and uh, once that is selected so family two um nope that is wrong uh three meters by 1.5 meters this is a problem that we usually have within our diamond facade so guys check this out this is a diamond facade but uh, let's try to improve this a little bit how about we go to smooth shadows um all right we need to exit from that menu okay and uh, we need to convert our facade i mean uh, not convert rotate our facade apply and check this out guys this is our facade look at how beautiful it is but uh wait let me we, you know we'll fix this in a while finish mass um let's go to massing inside uh do not i do not want to see that and uh hit lines and uh graphics and displays so okay now all of these commands are back uh sketchy lines let's enable sketchy lines depth hue okay lightning um top left all right and uh, let's go to photograph exposure let's go to background let's go to sky okay yes and this is it guys look at how beautiful our fakir is and uh, you know there can be small windows on this side and uh, this is the uh, the diamond um shaped fakir look at how um beautiful it looks and uh, you know it's completely parametric right so we can change all of these values uh the way we did it in our i mean the the way we did it in our fakir family
so i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you <laughs> excuse me i hope you learned something from this and uh, you know i've i've speed up my video so if you want to learn from this uh, make sure to slow it down and uh, have a good day and uh, bye bye take care of yourself all right